classic strawberry. How are you all doing? Hmm, I can see that all of you are doing fine. Good. So shall we continue with our lessons? Now children, the topic that I'm going to do today has been taught in school before. Now the topic is personal pronouns. Well, if you have forgotten, don't worry. Teacher is going to do the lesson once again. Now shall we look at the board? Alright children. Now, personal pronouns. What are personal pronouns? Now, personal pronouns replace the names of nouns. Example, Jane. Jane is a girl. The personal pronoun used for girl is she. Next, Peter. Peter is a boy. Now, the personal pronoun used for boy is he. The next one, pet the dog. Now, the dog is an animal. So, what is the personal pronoun for dog and animal? It is it. It. Write the next one, a bag. A bag is a thing. Now, the personal pronoun for thing is also it. So remember, animals, things, they take the same personal pronoun, which is it. Next, Jane and Peter. Jane and Peter. The personal pronoun for two is they. They. Jane, Peter, Pat, the dog, and I. Then the personal pronoun becomes we. Now, when it ends with I, you always use the personal pronoun we. And the other two pronouns are I and you. Let's watch a short video on personal pronouns. I am sure after watching this video, you will be able to understand the topic better. Now let's watch the video. Personal pronouns Singular I, you, he, she it plural we you they pronouns take the place of a noun a noun is a person place animal or thing i I, you, you, he, he, she, she, it, it, I, you, he, she, it, replace only one person or Thing. One boy, he. One girl, she. One book, it. A sheep, it. We, we. You, you. They, they, we, you, they replace a group of people or things. A boy and a girl, they, me and my brother, we, two dogs, they. 
All right, children. How did you find the video? I'm sure it was good, and you would have understand the lesson better. So, let's do some exercises from your book. Now, children, please have this book in front of you. Assessment book, level six, and turn to page one. Personal pronouns. Fill in the blanks with the correct personal pronouns. I, we, she, he, you. Now, this passage is about my best friend. Now, to start the lesson, I will help you out. Now, the first personal pronoun that you have to write here is I. I have a best friend. Her name is Grace. Now Grace is a girl. So which personal pronoun should I use? Is it she or he? She. She. Are you sure? Yes. Good. Because the personal pronoun for girl is she. So, she is eight years old. Grace is also my Neighbor, go to the same school, meaning Grace and you go to the same school. So what is the personal pronoun? You and your friend. We. Very good. So we, the two of you, we go to the same school. Grace's father sends us to school every morning. Is a doctor. Now this is Grace's father. Now what is the pronoun that we use for father? Which is a man. Boy. Man. Is it you? He or she? He. He. Yes, because father is the male gender. So we use he. He is a doctor. Now Grace's mother fetches us from school every afternoon. Is a teacher in our school. Now we are talking about Grace's mother. Now mother is a female or a girl. So what is the pro personal pronoun for mother? Is it we, she or he? She. She. Good. Because... Mother is a female or a girl. I like my best friend very much because she is kind. Do have a best friend? Asking you all, do have a best friend. So what do I put here? You. Right. Do you have a best friend? Now let's read this again. I have a best friend. Her name is Grace. She is eight years old. Now we put the personal pronoun she because it's 
Grace. Grace is a girl. Grace is also my neighbor. We go to the same school. Now we are talking about Grace and you. So you have to say we go to the same school. Grace's father sends us to school every morning. Here we are talking about her father. So the personal pronoun for father, the male gender is he. So he is a doctor. Grace's mother fetches us from school every afternoon. Now talking about her mother, Grace's mother, she is a female or a girl. So we have to use the personal pronoun she. She is a teacher in our school. I like my best friend very much because she is kind. Do you have a best friend? Yeah. Good. We should all try to have a best friend. Now children, turn to page 2. Now, fill in the blanks with the correct personal pronouns. The words in brackets, these are brackets, will indicate, meaning will show you which pronoun to use. Number one, we are talking about Bill. Bill is reading a book. Now Bill is a boy. So can you tell me what pronoun is that? Is it he or she? He. He. So H E he. He is reading a book. The next one, the book. Now we are talking about the book. The book is blue. The book is blue. Now for book, things. Do we say he, she? No. So what do we use? It. Very good. We say it. We cannot say he or she. The next one, Jill. Jill has a brother. This is Jill. Jill is a girl. So the personal pronoun for girl, Jill, is he, she, or we? She. She. So Jill has a brother. So the personal pronoun will be she. She has a brother. The next one. My brother and I. My brother and I. The two of you. My brother and I are watching television. So, my brother and I will be we or is it they? We. We. And why? Why do we use we and not they? Because of the I. Yes. Remember, teacher said when it ends with the I, we say we and not they. Good. The next one. The cat is chasing a mouse. Now, the cat is an animal. So, the personal pronoun for animal is? It. it. Remember? Animal. Thing. They use the same personal pronoun which is it. The next one. Sarah and Jane went to see a movie. 
Now Sarah and her friend. Now, when we go with our friends, we say we went to see a movie or they went to see a movie. They? Yes, they. They went to see a movie. Sarah and Jane went to see a movie. The next one, Mr. Tan. Mr. Tan is my math teacher. This is Mr. Tan. He is a man. So for a man, a male, do we say he or do we say she? He. He. Remember, for a male, whether it's a man or a boy, we use the personal pronoun he. He is my math teacher. Next one, Jack and Jill are eating satay at the restaurant. Now the two girls are eating satay at the restaurant. Now do we say we, she or they? They. They. Remember, we are not talking about ourselves. But we are talking about two different people other than us. So Jack and Jill will be come they. They are eating satay at the restaurant. Now let's go to page 3. My sister likes to eat ice cream. My sister. Now sister is a girl. So do I say he, she, we or I? She. She. Remember girl is she. The personal pronoun for girl is she. Next, my pet. Now look at this animal. What animal is this? Dog. Dog. Now, my pet has brown spots and a long tail. Brown spots and a long tail. Now, the dog, is it a thing or an animal? Animal. Animal. So, remember, thing and animals, they use the same pronoun. Do you remember what the personal pronoun is? Yes. What is it? It. It. Very good. So, it has brown spots and a long tail. The next one, John and Harry. John and Harry love to eat pizza. Now, can you see the two of them? So, what is the personal pronoun that we use? Is it we or is it they? Day. Day, because we do not have the word I here. So we say they love to eat pizza. The next one. Danny, Jenny and I and I enjoy going to school. So Danny, Jenny and I. It ends with I. So what is the personal pronoun? We. We. Remember when it ends with the I? The personal pronoun should be we. We enjoy going to school. The next one. The books are not on the table. So now children, we have got so many books here. So what do you think the personal pronoun should be? Is it it, we or they? They. They, correct. Because it's many. So we cannot say it. So they are not 
on the table. When it's plural, we have to use the plural form. Even if it was the dogs, we use as they. Now me have three books and three pencils. You are talking about yourself. So the personal pronoun used for me when you say about yourself. Can you tell me what is that personal pronoun? I. I. Very good. I have three books and three pencils. The next one. Are you coming with me? Now he is asking him. Are you coming with him? So what is a personal pronoun? Is it I, you, he, or they? You. Very good. So there is no change. You use the same word, the same personal pronoun. Are you coming with me? Now children, there are many many more parts of the pronouns. You will learn about them in the coming lessons. So don't worry, don't be confused. With time, you will be able to learn this personal pronoun and all the other pronouns that come with it. Alright children, now before we end our lesson, let's play a simple game. Now I hope you remember the topic that we did earlier. Personal pronouns. Now children, I know this topic is a bit difficult for you. But don't worry, once we are back in school, I will do a revision on this topic. But let's see in the meantime if you remember what you have learned in the video. Now, look at the first word, girl, girl. What's the personal pronoun that we use for girl? Is it it, they, she, we or he? She. She. Very good. So remember children, girl, the personal pronoun for girl is she. The next word, dog, dog. Now dog is an animal. So what is the personal pronoun that we use for an animal? It, they, we or he? It. Very good. It. The personal pronoun for animal is it. The next word. Mom and dad. Mom and dad are two people. So, do we say they or we? Mm, they. Very good. We use the personal pronoun. They for two people. The next word. Jet. Jet. So jet, what is the personal pronoun for jet? Is it it, we or he? It. It. Very good. Because it comes under things. So it. The next one. Cat and I. Can you see the word I there? Cat and I. I. So what is the personal pronoun for cat and I? Is it we or he? He. Wait. I think it should be we. Very good. It is we. Good. And the last one we have boy. He. Okay, very good children. He. So now children, 
Girl, personal pronoun is she. Dog, it is it. Mom and dad, it is they. Jet, it is it. Cat and I, it is we. And boy, it is he. Good job, children. But don't worry. We will continue the lesson and do a revision again when we are back in school. The class of six strawberry, we have come to the end of our lesson. We'll meet again in the coming week. In the meantime, stay safe, stay well and take care of yourself.